So, I've been playing a little bit off screen. A bit of grinding? Just a little bit. How'd that go for you? I think it went all right. Yeah? Got uh, anything cool to talk about? Uh, well, yeah, let me just show. You know, those are... Those are always the infamous words, as I've been grinding a little bit off screen, but uh, check it out. Oh, I see a few new names in yes. there. Yes, so levels and uh, wow, and such. Right now, Th right. Thoth is in, maxed out on the uh, on the loyalty, yes. so that's cool. Buff demonstrate. Still walking around because the scavenging ability is fantastic. All right, we got you up to max. You're our mind reader. Mamudo still strong. That's cool. Rakasha is your Rakshasa. I'm always gonna say it wrong, but <laughs> old reliable. And there we go. We got ourselves. Big oh yeah, Matsumi. Boy. So Mabufudine. he's our cooldown Mabufudine boy. Exactly. He's doing the ice. Um, he's big and slow, but he'll do it. Then we've got this, which. Let's be real. I kind of don't care. I'm gonna look. I'm, I'm gonna fuse this up as soon as I can. Okay. You know, I'm Put just. Put it in your sword. I'm keeping it around for now. Is no, no, no. I'm just. It's it's an ingredient for fusion. Okay. So we'll figure it out later. There Got we go. Got ourselves a show ten. Big um, big uh, elephant. You're gonna be our our use force and mighty blow, boy. Not bad. We oh, got, we got Arahabaki, yes. Already. The color, again, it used to be blue, so I'm not used to these colors, but we do have one. It's a level 53. Uh, Petromedia Hex. Seems like a nice combo. Power. That's cool. That's really cool. Mezandine, Force Wind, everything. Sama Recarm, Resurrect, Full Life, Scout and Fly. Mishiguchi, as you remember. And... Pyro oh, spell. We're chasing that. We earlier. fought it once, exactly. The the I, I was calling it like the cert reskin. But this is our fire boy that casts ice as well. Okay. And he's got the uh, ignite on him, so Ice and Fire. Incubus. Pagan Incubus. Marin Karen. Wind cutter. Marin fucking Karen. It's the charm what, ability. What is What's going on with Incubus? Yes, what's what are you that? are you familiar with what an incubus is? What what would be a proper definition? Oh. Hold on a second. Oh, it's a horse thing. The, the cow. I can see it. A new capital shall arise from the flames of the old. The indomitable hearts of people shall carve a new destiny. Okay, get it, get it, get it. Uh, let's see. So I there is apparently like you can plan for this pretty hard to kill um but let's see if we can do it with something that's gonna hit hard like our misspell our, our misspell might do it oh my god damn it my controller needs juice oh no worst timing <laughs> actually best timing because we're, we're paused it could have been in game yeah it could have been uh, do you know what an incubus is? No. Okay, so it's a band that has a. a That's so all I know. Yes. <laughs> and uh, I really like the song they do called Mexico. It's good. But beyond that, it is a male succubus. Okay. So it is the equivalent of a Morrigan, except packing. Exactly. Coming into the windows at night to do the exact same thing steal your energy. But. If Morgan is not your style, then perhaps the Incubus is. I mean, it was massive. Demons are fl have flavors for all kinds. Everybody. It was a big Incubus. <laughs> we'll read about it in a second. Let me bring up the misspell. Okay. All right. Let's have you use your magic attacks. Get closer. And it's gonna be all on you. And it's so healthy. Not that. Does it have a weakness? Uh, no. Nope. Did it heal itself? Or did that heal them? All right. Not that's not gonna cut it. How about power? <laughs> How 
is this cow with a wedding veil the most... It's just, yeah, it's a little bonus <laughs> demon. And it showed up in the tower to give some tips about, like, other stuff I'll tell you about in a second. Use your magic. Uh... Let's go power. Oh, there we go. Let's go. Oh, we're getting it. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, no. And it's healing. Fuck. Ah, right. Okay. Rough. How are you gonna get yourself a cow? Um, you have to probably find the weakness that's gonna change each time. Oh, every time? If it's, if it's like the gold slimes, it'll be like, you find the right weakness, and then, you know, Damn, okay. try to exploit it. It helps, too, if you have, um... If you find the weakness and you attack, you build up the combo meter. That then allows you to do skills. Yeah. So if you have a nice aggressive skill at the same time, that's really handy. Better luck next time then. Uh, yeah. Okay. So I went to the de to the demon tower right uh, over where we were in the training grounds there. Yeah. And I did multiple layers down up to the ninth out of ten floors. Okay. Ten floors still yeah. blocked off. So um, still not strong enough for the tenth floor. No. Oh, you need a tracker chip. Here. Uh, but what? So what we did do in the meantime is we ended up getting into we that that cow would show up and it'd be like, hey, when it's a full moon, go to this st stand on this square and something will happen or whatever. And then like I went there and then a big uh, gauntlet happened where you have to kill. All, I think it's like a hundred demons in one fight. It felt like you had to fight a hundred demons. And then you, I, I did that twice, and both times I was given a reward. The first one I was given was the Phantom Skull. Required credentials to meet the Demon Lord. And then the second one was the Emblem of Hell. Uh, they were both really long fights. Uh, but, you know, with a strong demon, you can hold them off and do it, so... We have these, we'll figure out what's going on with that, perhaps Ooh, when we get strong Lord. enough yeah. Yeah, to, to get to the bottom. And I do know that um, in the compendium, there are demons that are not going to show up until you, like the Yoshitsune, find them, unlock them, and okay. then, you know... Encounter them first. Exactly. So, um, we're going to have to see if we can if we can get that done before we wrap things up. Uh, so what about these demons? So, yeah. the spell. Fire giant of Norse mythology, said to live in the flaming land of Muspelheim. Ah, oh, that's what the name references. Yeah, that makes sense. He stays away from the humans and the gods, but during Ragnarok, he will invade the human world. Right on. Norse badass. demon, very cool. What about the Arahabaki? Oh, one, the, oh, go ahead, go ahead. one of the main deities of ancient Japan, its appearance is modeled after clay statues. Worship of it was taboo for long periods as it was seen as treacherous to the emperor. All Cult right. of personality, only one. There you go. Shoten. God of esoteric Buddhism, equivalent to Ganesha of Hindu mythology. It bears benefits such as wisdom, luck, and health, but half-hearted devotion turns them to a curse. You better mean it. Gotta mean it. Yep. Don't fake it. Incubus. That's... That's... Are you intimidated? Dude. Does is that, is that leather? <laughs> is that leather? I mean, oh it's... God. There's a brief there. Like, it's strapped yep. up. Yep. It's strapped. Mm -hmm. These cats are strapped. Demon originating in European folklore, the incubus is the male counterpart to the succubus. Ravishes women while they sleep, impregnating them and causing nightmares. Yeah, it would do that. Got it? It would cause nightmares indeed. There you go. <sighs> it's such a shame Mara's not in this game. There's some real good demons I'd like to introduce you to. Oh. Okay. <laughs> that sounds good. Uh, six in the hierarchy of angels, residing in the second sphere. Their task is to protect heaven from demons and oversee the distribution of power among humans. There you go. The power.
power. It was a native god worshipped in the Shinano region before the Yamato power took control. Said to be a god born from the ancient belief that rocks and stones sheltered divine spirits. Alright. Hmm. Oyamatsumi. Japanese god of the Kunitsu, he is the grandfather of Kushinada Hime, Susano's wife. Oh, wow. Known best as a mountain god, but also a god of water and the fields due to his control over them. Please be nice. And Cerberus, you know. Guardian hound of Hades in Greek mythology, traditionally it has three heads and a snake's tail. It's the offspring of Typhon, the god giant of wind, and Echidna, or Echidna, the mother of monsters. There you go. Yeah. Not bad. I would like to think that, uh, I think we, did we? Science skeleton? Monster yes, yeah, we did do this one. Things. Hunger. Yeah. So there you go, that's that's our little lore update. Uh, I would like to think that, like, um, while different games have different demons, and uh, the range kind of spreads out a bit, in this case, I feel like uh, a lot of this is hyper-focused on Japan because it's old Japan. Yeah. So what people believe in the most in this area is going to be like ancient Japanese shit, you know, and then a little bit of outside influence, you know, that'd be that that'd be my headcanon for the situation. Okay. So. So you done a, you did a lot. Actually. We did a lot. We're pretty strong, ready to hopefully take on a cool giant mecha. Oh yeah, we have to go to the science lab, right? Science lab, exactly. Um, I always forget which station it's at, but there's also like exploring the water ways wherever possible. Um, so let's just waste some money. Is it? Is it uh, it's. Fukugawa? I want to say Ginza or Fukugawa. Well, it was early. I think it's Fukugawa. Yeah. All right. The bathhouse. Mountain of junk issues, mountain of treasure. Not everyone is smart enough to know. Keep your eyes wide open, just like a real investigator. We'll see I should have let that slip. There'll be a less here for me to claim. Yeah. Amazing. So amazing. How's dog doing? Whoa. Oh shit. The soulless god caused an earthquake. He's getting restless. Oh. Um, <laughs> I'm busy right now, kid. What do you want? Can it wait? You saw that giant robot tearing the capital apart, didn't you? Our city's gonna be in rubble in no time at all. Mm. So I'm gonna hit that ugly mug with my rocket and smash it to smithereens. Get a move on, you're in my way. Interesting idea. Would a rocket be enough to take that Colossus down? Not sure. Wouldn't the rocket be put to better use destroying the satellite? Let's see what he thinks, Shohei. Raido informed Dr. Dr. Sukumo of the satellite served as the soulless god's power source. What? The satellite siphoning power to that monster? Uh -huh. And you want to use my rocket to destroy the satellite? Yep. That's inconceivable. Hitting the satellite that's floating in space with an unmanned rocket? Not even possible. Without knowing precise data, the satellite's orbit, speed, etc., etc., yeah. <laughs> it can't be done. Besides, even if we could hit it, there's no guarantee it would be destroyed. Looks like we only got one shot at this, Joe. Hey, we have to find a way to get the data he wants. We have to do it before we sap the wastes, before the sap wastes the rocket on the solar god itself. Who do you think might have an inside link with the army? Hmm. Mm hmm. 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 The dog! Hey, dog. Still chilling. Yeah, he does. Wants to talk? What you gotta say? Want some kibbles? <laughs> no! I'm sorry, are you uncomfortable? This is going to read the mind. <laughs> this is. There's only one thing that you can be. Reading and it's what the f <laughs> stay away from me. Strapped. <laughs> Sheba starts can be heard. My dream is to return to that forest where I grew up. 
and I remember your dream is to pet you. Dreams give us hope to keep on living for humans and dogs a lot. Never forget that. Damn, dude. Yeah. I hope you can come with us to space. You know that dog would bite the succubus and never let go. Yeah. Correct. Intruder at yeah. night. Bed intruder. Go. Attack. Mm-hmm. Uh, let's get our, uh... Our scavenger out. Dope. What about you? What you got? The drunken hobo? People without any goals in life are idiots. But the ones who chase their goals without thinking are of others are even bigger idiots. Dropping some street wisdom. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what you gotta say? Transmissions from Jupiter can be heard. I don't need to prepare. I'll do it by sheer force of will. I like that. Well, I guess that's one way of thinking about it. It's good. Ooh. Whatever the fuck that means. You do it. Hey, while we're out here, why don't we go grab some soda? Oh, yeah. Um, how's the moon? It's about to go towards full, I guess. It's gonna reset at the new moon. Don't forget. Wonder if those kids are playing at the factory are all right. The monsters looming over the Kotoku and mid and all. I hope they took the train straight home. Fuck them kids. Uh, what was this again? I'm not sure. It's been a while since we've been in this area. A training hall. Did we do this one? <gasps> we didn't. Another one. Oh. Are you down? Okay. Maybe you can just see what's around the floor. It's a demon training hall. Yeah. All right. A couple items to grab. No biggie. All right, do it real quick. Le spell. Or power. Someone who can survive and or heal themselves. Yeah. Uh, well, in that case, um, we want Rakshasa. Doing a lot of good work for you, huh? Yeah, the self-healing is is uh, fucking clutch and particular. Uh, let me just confirm. Uh, our Habaki also, but yeah, Rexasa. All right, let's see how this works. Go. Here I go. And he doesn't fly too slow either. Which is nice, because, like, the big stone golem yeah. is like, uh, uh, uh. You know, it's really slow. When you go solo with him? Yeah. Or just walking around the, the map to fight. More money. Bit of wood. Alright, now, let's cross this way to see if there's not a fight waiting for us. No. Nope. Sometimes there's, like, a boss waiting right there. Yeah, be careful. Mm. Magical defense increased. Oh, they track too. Okay. Yeah, this is oh, this is gonna be tricky. Rough. That hurt. But now they're far away. Okay, nice heal. Man, Rido sure is helpful. <laughs> get one of them. Doing it. Doing it. Just gotta get the right angle. Uh-oh. Okay, that's good. One more. This is the most complicated thing in the game, going solo. Yes. 
clearly. Stop cornering yourself. It's again. It, it's clearly not the best thought out mechanic. God damn it. <laughs> oh, you're not close enough. There you go. You know. And, like, it's all because of your movement speed. Like, that's the entire struggle. Uh... Let's keep... Okay, yeah. yeah. Oh. Just and she? One. Oh, that's a trap, is it? That's gonna be a... A few more enemies, or...? We're good. We're good. Oh no, just out of the range. Okay. If it moved at the same speed as Rido running around, we'd be fine. You know? Another mirror. And... Alright. Coin. You good? Yeah. Almost a full moon. Uh-oh. Yeah, that's super fast. Come on. Come on. Let's just collect. No time to waste. Yeah. Another mirror. In your pockets. If if uh, Yoshitsune is the only one that we find in in these training halls, I'm gonna be a little disappointed. Mm. I was hoping we'd find like cool demons in each one. Oh, oh it's been a while since I've seen Nami. All right, let's take her out first. Yeah, before she messes with yeah. you. Yeah. Still tough. Okay. Spin it, spin it. Uh oh. Okay. You can still control him? Yeah. I think we just do more. You, you give and take more damage in Frenzy. Okay. So... Yeah, I don't recall seeing It's that. like a Berserker state. You know, everything hurts more, everything takes more. So it's not always a bad thing. And a Chalice. There we go. Alright. Okay. Got maybe like 50k in your pockets right now. Just from cleaning this. Not yet. And it's almost a new moon, isn't it? Uh, almost full, I believe. Which is when we want to uh, take a drink. Uh, Did it just go backwards? It went full. Seven and I was going back towards new right now. Okay. So what you want is to drink right at the new moon. Mm hmm. All right, so that is all the uh, training halls on the overworld, as far as I know. Because that's four of them. Just missing that tenth floor, right? Yeah, so there's the, that's the north, south, east, west, and then the, 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 the other one is the one at the, um, the shrine. Okay. Uh, so now, maybe we can go talk to Moli Moli. Wherever he might yeah, be. Yeah, said the Sadakichi. Haramicho, probably. Uh, yeah. We got the Navy spot. Oh shit! Damn. Oh shit! Why is it flashing in dual look colors? At the, look at the top right. Oh my god! Yo, it's right there. First special guards in red. Oh my god. Capital's getting way too exciting. Exciting? Move! Get out of there! <laughs> what? Oh my god. It's not friendly. Holy shit. 
It's on the overworld. Okay. That's pretty fucking sick. I wonder if you can swim to it. I think so. <laughs> like, the color of this city means it's clearly affected. And I, I'm under the impression that we can start some shit. Prematurely, possibly, even. Meaning that, I guess, when we're ready to take it on, we just fly up to it. First, the special guards in the red, now the, and the uniform attack. Now, monster and an earthquake. We must keep Hermitcho civilian safe at all costs. Yes, do your best. All right, last time Sadakichi was hanging out over here. What about now? Ooh, don't get poisoned. Yeah, you're not the right one. Um, need some ice. Where is she? Oh, let's go! Oh, I thought he'd be bigger. No, it's not crazy. He's, he's just a big stone boy. Do your thing. Uh, attack, attack. Oh, he's doing it. He's gonna do it. Yeah. That was good. Yeah. It's great. But he, he takes a while to get started. But, but then he gets going. <laughs> you know what? You don't have to be that big if you're gonna be that cool. That's cool. Also, he is big. It's just they're big too, and there's like six of them. My oh, this guy. Is. Oh, God. Get away from him. Yeah. Oh, get that checked, dude. Need some calamine lotion. Even from here, from here, I could feel the heat. I hope the people by the ocean are all right. The soulless god caused an earthquake. Another one. Half moon. Hello there. It's you, Rido. What on earth is going on here? <laughs> just, just look over there. Uh, fuck eyeballs. <laughs> so that's what Monokato was trying to achieve. Is the capital really done for? Is there nothing, no way to stop that thing? What satellite, huh? I don't know much if this will help, but I can give you the information I collected for the Navy. Oh, good, leaking information. SS project report. Those that are all, those are all the files that we confiscated in our investigation, including a detailed report on the Taiyutsu satellite. A little bit above my head, though, to be honest. Wah, wah. Satellite above your head. Pretty good. <laughs> I'm going ahead uh, to say we're kind of on you with this one, Rido. You have to protect the capital from that soulless god. I mean, more than just the capital at risk right here, but, you know, sure. Uh, World domination. Whirlwind sucked all the heat from the fires into one place, igniting the atmosphere. Whoa. The impact of the blast leveled to Rumi show. How bad is it? Just walk, walk away. away. <laughs> oh, okay. Mid talking. Yeah, the, the screams of the people are rising. <laughs> All right, I'll see you when I'll see. One eighty <laughs> aggressively, so that your cape slaps him in the face as you walk away. There's no property damage, but some people have died of heat stroke. Have you seen the tragedy at the shipyards? Some unfortunate people dived into the ocean, desperate to escape the heat. Damn. Mm-hmm. Kind of cool. Okay. So what now? Uh, well, we'll take the, we can take the reports over to the, to the uh, science dude. Yeah, but like, what if we just go? Game over. Yeah, I kind of I kind of want to know. <laughs> okay. Uh, I don't think there's a quick save no. nearby. You know what? Here, let's just let's just see it. Let's just get right up under its dawn. Going somewhere, Sunny? <laughs> Going around? Let's just didn't let's, see nothing. Let's just peep, <laughs> peep it from a distance. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe there's some other stuff around here to look at. Did we get everything on this map? We just did that over there. 
Yeah, I'm, a li I'm, I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little scared of the soulless god right now. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> and the, Welcome to the And the off. red screen, you know, yeah, okay, you know what? Let's just leave it alone. <laughs> you had so much courage a second ago. Ready to be an explorer? I am ready to be an explorer. Yeah, no, I know. Just let me. No business here. God damn it. I have courage according to whenever my last save was. <laughs> it refills every time. There you, save. you go. So let's just let's just be smart here. Let's get back home. Make a save. Someone here? Hey. Yeah. Mommy's chilling. I might doubt that Heap can actually fly, but no, forget it. There's no time to waste. Let's do our jobs. Right on, the Uh, eleven. Yeah, oh. over here. Right. Yeah, as you can see, that was an extra five hours of grind. Damn. Yeah. All right. So, uh, back out. Returning to Fukagawa. And like, yeah, let's just, let's just, you know. See if the game even entertains the idea. Uh. Gonna show that doctor that it's possible to go. Oh wait, no, hold on. No, we want no, that's not what we wanted. We wanted to go to Harumi. Oh yeah, you wanted to drink up, right? Or something? Is that what you're thinking of? I do want to drink up. Um <laughs> Here. Uh what do you got? Thank you. Retract water. Yeah, you want to level up? Also, I he found like a beat of life or two off screen. So okay, I'm I'm on his side. Um, as long as it's not trying to show you stuff. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Also, we have these, uh, which I haven't. I've only used a couple, but these are little toys for toys for um, Goto. Don't play cat and mouse with me. You don't want to see me with my tail in the air. Ugh, you're so stubborn, I'm telling you. I won't budge. That thing, I won't. <laughs> oh, he's tempted. He is tempted. Mm. It's nothing. I'm fine. <laughs> Just give in to it. Just give in to it. I won't play with you just for that. We're wearing him down. We're slowly wearing him down. One day. One day you'll crack. Yeah, I just want- I'm just exploring a little bit right okay. now. I was wondering where you were going right now. Um, to confront the soulless god. By foot. Cool. Balls on this man. Look at these wood ornaments. I just want to know if the game even allows you to prematurely approach. Now that we've saved, all my confidence is back. Get stepped on. Yeah. Nothing. Nothing. You can smell its crotch. You can't. <laughs> can't get a, do nothing. Get a good whiff. Oh my god. That's about it. Unfortunately. Oh? No. That's about as far as we can go. Wah, wah. Alright, well, let's go have a drink, huh? Let's booze up. Let's soda. It's soda. Uh, north exit? Yeah. So down the street. 
one phase away from the new moon. Wow, that guy's just chilling on the floor, eh? Uh, what do you have to say? Did you feel that earthquake just now? Ali was caught in front of the army car when it careened off the road and she... The soldier tried to brake, but the wheels were caught on the railroad tracks. Oh, that sounds terrible. Can we help these people? My hand slipped off the wheel and all that shaking. I lost control. I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. She oh. has passed away. Damn. I can't use magic? That's... That's messed up. That's dark. That's yeah. That's very dark considering what we've seen in the game up to now. I really... I hope it's not like... The more earthquakes you experience as you... Oh, god damn it. Baited. <laughs> we need to go to the, the far side. Like, the more earthquakes that go off as you run through the city, the worse things get. The more chaotic it becomes. Yeah. Everyone is doomed, Wooly. Doomed. Alright, we just passed the new moon. Yep, we are on one. Alright. Let's go. Oh, yeah. That, uh, the, the Hyper Imperial, um, flag as well. The huge red thing fell from the sky. After that, a, pre a monster came up from the sea. What's going on? So the, one, the, 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 the there's the, the Japanese flag and then there's the, the sunburst flag, you know? Yeah. Um, and then there was a flag that was raised in a couple, in a, 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 a couple battles in, during World War II. Um, that was a reference to like a 1908 or so naval battle it's like it's a special, tr like, multicolored flag oh. that is only used by the Navy, and it's specifically raised to say the future of the entire fate of the Empire rests on this battle. Give it a thousand percent. On brand. It's a special flag for, like, it all comes down to this, you know? And it's it was only up. and it was only flown, like, there a couple times in history, I'm like two or three times. One. Yeah. All right, uh, let's order ourselves a mandra. Wait, these were combinations of... You know what? You got more for drinking them all anyway, if I remember correctly. It was like two bucks or something? Magic increased Magic and luck. luck increased. So dragon must have been like uh, strength, strength and vitality. Which is the two that I actually want. There we go. Great. Full of juice. Ah, so it's been some time, Mr. Summoner. I've nearly completed the research. What would you like to hear? New uh, rumors. This is what I hear as I walk around the capital. Ow. Ah, yes, one of the things. This is hard to believe, but you should know. There have been sightings of a cow yes. with a human face lately around yes. the capital. It is not easy to find, and they say it runs away as soon as people see it. If you should see such a thing, you will let me know. We, oui? bonsoir, Monsieur Summoner. We saw the cow. Doomsday in the capital. Many areas of the southern capital have been reduced to rubble. Fires, earthquakes, and tsunamis are ravaging the city, claiming the lives of many citizens. Wild theories abound, the most popular of which are reports of a giant destructive monster. Whatever the cause, the capital is rapidly becoming a death trap, and we urge all citizens to evacuate. The article continues. Wow. Everyone is aware of the troubles that have fallen on this city. All right. So, uh, now back to the amazing science lab. Bunk, bunk. Uh, yes. 
always have to like think super hard about where mm -hmm. we're going. Man, if you could buy that soda to go, God, that'd be incredible. Yeah, you, you would, would stack up nine. You just stack up. Yeah, you literally wouldn't. It, I mean, it would be unfair. Hello. Still busy, you meddling kid. Come back later, I said. Read this, idiot. Huh? What's this? I say, it's a report on that satellite of yours. It shows the blueprint, power, source, mass, output, capacity. That's everything about it. Uh -huh. Dude, close your mouth, man. <laughs> hmm. Sokolsky's equation. Sielkovsky. I heard a rumor about a Russian scientist that developed a rocket theory. Always the Russians. Yep. Grozny grad. Does this mean that they use this research to launch the satellite? Assuming so, I could use this equation to launch my own rocket into space, but wouldn't you know it's been written in Russian? I can't read how I word of it. Oh no. Even if I had a way to read it, this indicates the satellite's heavily armored. Certain my rocket wouldn't be able to destroy it anyway. Seems our luck's run out. The rocket might not destroy the satellite, but it'd get us close enough to do the job. We could destroy the satellite ourselves as long as we had a way to reach it, right? First things first, though. Do we know any Russians? I don't know, do we? Mm. Or at least someone who knows how to read Russian? What about that Victor guy? He's from another country, right? He might know Russian. Oh. You still want the equation? You gonna find someone who can read it? I suppose it's better than just give it up. All right, here you go, but be quick about it. No use stopping that monster if it's already burned down the capital. Well, uh, yeah, actually, there's all the other things that are not the capital that you can still save, but, you know. One thing but go on, mind. but go on. Do we know any Russians? Besides the fucking one that powerfully sent us to another dimension? Yeah, long dong monk. Yeah, we know, we know Victor. I'm sure, uh... Rasp is gonna come back. Yo, you get into the, we get into a round three fight with Rasputin. You pull out your incubus and he's like, <laughs> uh -huh. yeah. He's like, that's cute. Oh, <laughs> are we doing a skin uh, battle? Are we trying to? Whoosh, we we trying to do this? We doing this? <laughs> Level question mark. Eyebrow raised. What's going on up there, Kuzunoha? It sounds serious. Ah, you've brought something I need to have a look at. I'm going to show Viktor Tsurkovsky's equation. Russian, eh? I picked up a little bit during my travels. It's a theory on space flight, as far as I can tell. What is it for? Mm -hmm. Try to explain the situation to Viktor. I understand. You need this equation so that you can launch your rocket. Though it is possible to launch a rocket using this equation, whether or not it reaches the satellite is a different story. You have to account for the Earth's rotation, humidity, wind velocity, gravity, speed and altitude. To account for all of those elements on top of the launch equation is... Even I can't do it. I would recommend giving up on this rocket plan and finding an alternative. That's the attitude that's gonna land us on the moon. Mm -hmm. By the end of the decade. An alternative? Jeez, Pops, we're all ears. There has to be some way to handle the calculation, Johei. If only we had more time. Right now, I'm working on a humanoid automaton with complex computations capi computation capabilities. It's like an artificial life form that can outthink human beings. Oh, that sounds way easier than calculating the trajectory <laughs> that we need to find to exit the atmosphere. In theory, he would be able to solve your equation, but of course, he would have to exist first. Artificial life form. Kind of gives me the heebie-jeebies. It's like, yeah, dude, sorry. I, we, we have not invented sufficient math that I can sit here and figure out the velocity that you need in the, in the rotational info, you know, by, like, staring at the stars and doing other basic things. Not that it's a basic equation, but... In the meantime, I've invented Skynet. <laughs> and Skynet can help figure that shit out. Right, little Skynet. Right. That reminds me. The Dark Summoner has a weird mechanical body, didn't he? I think he could handle all this ma mathematical nonsense. It's worth a shot, Joe, hey? It's true. So why didn't we just go talk to the first Russian? 
you had to listen to the suggestion, you know? If only I had an artificial man with calculating powers beyond that of human minds. Perhaps then I might be able to solve this equation! <laughs> Alas, my research has yet to make it to such an advanced stage! You know there are demons that are literally just robots too, you know? There's a couple of them. Demon bots? That you can just summon that's like, yeah, no, that that's a machine. <sighs> okay, where is he hanging out? Yeah, does Narumi know something about that? What up? <laughs>